Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today we're gonna be doing my office tour. We're gonna start off on this side of the room and this is pretty much the most important part where I do all my printing, all my machine work, all my fulfilling orders, everything like that, all the paperwork goes on right here. Throughout this video, I'm gonna say a lot of things are from Amazon and if I say it's from Amazon, it will be linked in the description. Let's get started. So over here, I've got a utility cart and I've actually got a matching one over there. These are from Amazon. I really needed something right here, right next to my desk where I could have all my little gadgets. We'll start with this top one. Um, this is where I keep like all my tripods, my microphone, extra batteries, some hair clips, my camera that is recording right now, and my camera's tripod. That's where I keep all this and it has to be on the top because I need it. I am always grabbing my camera, my tripod, things like that. So that's why it's on the top. This is actually to refill my tape dispenser that I have right there. And I just use it to pour the water in there. It's a little milk carton. I know some people have been wanting me to add this to the shop, but until I can find a stable manufacturer, uh, for these and I won't be able to add them But I do plan on adding these to the shop because I know a lot of people like them this middle drawer has all my my most important tool that I use, my paper shredder, love this thing. This is from Amazon, by the way. And this is also from Amazon. It is my label printer, which you will see what I use it for later on in the video. This is awesome, I really recommend this. It's literally a mini label printer. Prints out the labels right there, you just swipe up to cut it, super convenient. The box for it right here. Some little markers that I use for my sales map right there. I don't know where those are from, those were a gift. On the bottom right here, just got some like junk stuff. That's what we've got going on there. Now moving on to my favorite part of my office, which is my desk setup. It is so beautiful, of course, everything pink. Over here, I always keep like at least four bottles on hand, I'm not even kidding you. This is a new product and it will definitely be out by the time you guys are watching this video. So if you guys wanna check it out, it will already be up on the site. Right here, I've just got a little sign. This one's from Whole Goods. They have really cute home decor. This uh, keyboard mat is from Amazon. I love this thing so much because it's oversized and it fits perfectly on this desk. I really wanted something oversized because I don't like this singular mat. Over here, my external hard drive, things like that, not really important. Important. And then right here, I've just got all my tools that I use, like glue sticks, um, some extra tags, extra labels, tape, all my little supplies that I use on the daily is right here. Um, I got my little stickers for my scratch off cards, things like that. I get, I'm not even kidding you, probably 10 comments a day asking where my printers are from. So I'll start off with this printer. This is the Mumbin label printer. It's from Amazon and it is fantastic. I love it so much. Labels are completely free from UPS. These I used to use, but not so much anymore. These are from Amazon. This is my Holy Grail printer that everyone has been asking me about. I mentioned it in my packaging station tour video, so if you want it in depth on that, definitely go check that out. It's gonna to be towards the end of the video, at the very end, I think. So I'm not gonna to touch too much on it, but I will tell you that this is the, is the HP DeskJet. 2722. I don't think it's available anymore because I got it two years ago for like 24 bucks on a crazy sale. I pay $5.99 a month. This is like a subscription service. Haven't bought ink in over a year, so those are the basics that I'll tell you on that. Again, go watch that video if you wanna learn more, but this is a fantastic printer. Unfortunately, I don't think they sell it anymore. Moving on, my precious pink, beautiful Silhouette Cameo 4. I got this for Christmas. I did pick this out though, so I know exactly where to get it. I got a bundle off of Amazon. It came with a bunch of vinyl and all those things you need to get started. I also do have an unboxing video if you wanna check that out. Down here, I keep all my important papers and things like that. First off, I got my tracing paper that I literally love now because I'm able to make my own tissue paper with this. I have a tutorial on my TikTok. Here I have my little scale for when I weigh packages. I keep that here. I keep my photo glossy paper that I use for all of my DIYs. This is the best paper ever. Like there's so much you can do with this. And I have the Avery paper, which is what I use for my hang tags. It's double-sided, it's like a template, so it comes out perfect every time. But here I just have regular printer paper. And then down here, I have a candle that I never use. This is the pink paper that I use to make my paper shreds. I got it from Sam's Club. Then underneath that, I have more printer paper that I do get from Amazon. And then moving on to this section over here, I have an in-depth of what everything is on here on my packaging station tour, so I won't go too much into this. I'm gonna kind of just give you an overview. These shelves, these three shelves, are from Amazon. But here I keep some of this bubble wrap that I got in from my packages from Amazon or anything like that. 
uh, just in case I ever need any, I'd rather recycle than to buy some. And then I also keep some extra t-shirts and things like that in here to test designs or anything that I'm wanting to try out. Right here is like my silhouette station. It's pretty small right now because I'm still trying everything out. I just got some like permanent vinyl, heat transfer vinyl, my little supplies right there. Up here is just where I keep like packaging stuff, tissue paper, my tape. Custom tape is from Sticker Mule, link down below for $10 credit. Up here I've just got some extra mailers from Packagement. They're super cute so definitely check out uh, Packagement mailers. They're really nice. So all just supplies right here. Up here are my boxes that I use. I have seven by four by two I believe and then um, 12 by 9 by 3. I know some people were wondering about that. And moving on to my inventory. I try not to order a bunch of sizes anymore because they're just sitting here and if they don't sell, it's like kind of a waste. Um, I've got my small, medium, large, and extra large. And there is more large than any size here because that's what I usually wear. Sometimes if I want to size up, I'll go for the extra large. That's why I get mostly this size. In case it doesn't sell, I can use it for myself. So that's a little hack I've learned. This shelf, I keep like all all my shirts and stuff that I've already have on the site in case I need to use them in a video or anything like that. Here are a bunch of blanks that I want to try out for design. Down there I keep like extra inventory, some 2x sizes, and then some beanies and stuff like that that I want to try out as well. For here, this is like all my hair stuff, clips, and cups section. And then up here, I just have some finished sweatshirts that are on sale because I'm discontinuing these sand color sweatshirts because you can't find these anywhere. It's crazy. Like they just completely got wiped out. These two shelves are my clips section. I just released these. These will definitely be um, already up on the site by the time you guys see this. These mini clips and they're so cute. They come in like four different shades and I have different colors like blue and neutrals and things like that. So they're they're so cute, I really love these. This packaging I made myself. These containers are from Walmart and they were about $3 I think, but I don't really love them because they're kind of hard to stack. Underneath that one I have my groovy hair clips in here. Um, and those are just the flower hair clips that have the little cutouts in them. They're super cute. I've got all my flower clips here and that's what I use my mini label maker for i made these little like labels to categorize everything because some of them like won't be up front they'll be in the back and stuff chocolate and that's like that's not even one i think it's all the way back here yeah so see i've got them all the way i've got them scattered out so to keep it more organized and to know where everything is that's why i labeled them i reused my amazon boxes for these i prefer it this way too that way i can see everything it doesn't look cute but you know it works so down here i've got all my scrunchies and these bins are from marshall's it came in a pack of three for about 12 dollars, i believe stack a bunch of scrunchies on here which is nice down here i have my milk carton cups that i use it's probably going to be all drink storage if it goes well and i'll be able to buy more stock over here i've just got some more extra storage and then down there are some clips that i don't know if i'm going to release yet over here is my table that i use for packing all of my orders i also move this over here sometimes and do like my silhouette projects and things like that and next to that i've got a another utility card this is like my sewing station so i keep like all my threads in here i'm able to move this when i need to sew my sewing machine is in here but we're not going to get into the closet because it is a freaking mess and then this is the other section of my packaging station so again, if you want a more in-depth video on where every single thing is from, definitely check out that video. For organization, these are from Amazon. These are awesome. They're pegboard attachments. I can do so much on here and I still have space at the top right there. That is my office tour. I hope you guys like this video and let me know if there's anything else you want to see next and I will see you guys in the next one.